All right, now let's head over to Docurama. This week on Docurama, we're looking at Orson Welles' One Man Band. This is a German television documentary that looks back at the later days of Orson Welles, his life and his career, focusing primarily on those projects he never finished. And it is super fascinating to see those looks at things like Moby Dick and the other side of the wind, some of which were, all of which were never finished in Orson's lifetime, and most of which are still not finished today. You also get to see a lot of these weird little sort of comedy shorts, these almost Python-inspired comedy shorts that Wells was working on. There's a lot of his lover, Oya Kodar, in this one. Um, and to be completely honest with you, while looking at that footage is fascinating, it's a movie that is sort of boring, right? Like the, the in between the clips is not as interesting, is not as well done. It's also kind of sad, not just because he wasn't able to finish these and not just because some of these projects really aren't that good. They're fascinating. Orson Welles was always a genius. And, see, and any you know, scrap of what he was working on is at least from a historical or critical standpoint interesting to see, but it is kind of a bummer that what's here isn't necessarily that great. Now that said, it is hard to evaluate these things because they are just small clips of things. To give you a little bit of a spoiler, you know, these, these clips from the other side of the wind have been floating around for a long time. And when you see them here in One Man Band, they don't look very good. Recently though, Netflix finally finished and brought the other side of the wind to life. And it is a pretty amazing film. So God only knows if these snippets were taken and finished properly what they would look like. It's also sad because, you know, to see the once great Wells diminished is in and of itself heartbreaking. To see him struggling and striving to finish, you know, these scraps, it's tough to see sometimes. So Orson Welles' One Man Band, it's a mixed bag. The footage is interesting to see, but the documentary itself is a little thin. Two and a half stars. And don't forget to visit our website, northmetrotv.com slash everymovieever. There, you can watch reviews of every movie we've ever covered here on the show, as well as complete episodes. That's northmetrotv.com slash everymovieever.